During Jesus' ministry, he did more than just heal people, feed people, and preach to people. He also took time to rest and spend time with friends. Three of his closest friends were Mary, Martha, and Lazarus, two sisters and their brother. Jesus spent time at their home in the village of Bethany, enjoying meals, conversation, and wonderful fellowship. While Jesus was far away with his disciples, he received news that Lazarus had become very ill. Jesus was saddened by this and learned that Mary and Martha were hoping that he would come back and heal Lazarus. Though Jesus loved Lazarus, he decided not to go. Two days later, Jesus still did not go to Lazarus. Then more news came that Lazarus died. Everyone was sad, especially Lazarus' family. Jesus was deeply sad as well. Jesus told the disciples that Lazarus was just asleep. Jesus was trying to explain to them that he was more powerful than death. But the disciples could not understand it. In the end, they went to Lazarus' home. When he finally arrived at the house, Jesus learned that his dear friend Lazarus had been dead for four days. Many friends and family members were there, grieving with the sisters. Mary and Martha were mourning their brother, weeping, and wishing that Jesus had come sooner. If you had been here, my brother wouldn't have died, Martha sobbed when she saw Jesus. Jesus spoke to her tenderly. Your brother will rise again. I am the resurrection and the life. Whoever believes in me will not die but live. Jesus, along with the crowds of mourners, went to Lazarus' tomb. When he arrived at the spot, Jesus wept. As the onlookers saw Jesus weeping, they knew that he loved Lazarus deeply. Jesus was sad for Lazarus, but more so, he was sad that these people had such small faith. He was going to show them again that with God, anything was possible. So Jesus went and stood in front of the tomb and commanded, Take the stone away. Martha protested, Lord, there will be an odor, for he has been dead four days. Jesus looked at her, Believe, you will see the glory of God. Then Jesus prayed to God and shouted, Lazarus, come out. And then he came. Lazarus, still bound up with his burial attire, came out of the tomb. The crowd reacted in absolute surprise. Jesus had just commanded the dead to come to life. The family was reunited. Lazarus, who had become sick and died, now emerged from the tomb as healthy as any other man. It was true. Jesus is the resurrection and the life. That day, as a result of what Jesus did, many people believed in him.